Hey everyone, welcome back and happy Thursday. Okay guys, so we have so much to talk about, lots to discuss. Um, I did not know that Monica Garcia was going on Nick Bile, Biofile's podcast and saying that she was pregnant. So first of all, a huge congratulations to Monica Garcia from the Real Housewives of Salt Lake City. But also, I think that a lot of people, I'm seeing some of the comments and some are really nasty and I'm like, no. You cannot be mean to somebody who is with child and expecting. So we have a lots to, I guess, address, talk about, discuss. Also, I want to say yesterday, um, we ended up doing our Vanderpump Rules recap, but I was talking about my dog and some people were like, Adam, that is the part of owning a dog and you have to, if you can't handle it, then wah! And I'm like, I am like one of the best dog owners. I just was saying that my puppy ended up going to the bathroom in the house. That is it. And I was like, oh, I wasn't expecting that. And I had to clean it up. Not a big deal, guys. I am not a monster. So before we jump in, go ahead, smash that like button. If you're not subscribed, get subscribed. Don't forget to hit that notification bell and let's jump right in. Do it. All right, guys. So we're going to start here with Monica Garcia because I think that that is probably the best place to start. Now, I was not expecting her to reveal that she was pregnant with said child, but she did. And I'm like, wait a minute. We're all here for it. So this is exactly what was said. Thank you to page six. Real Housewives of Salt Lake City's Monica Garcia is pregnant, expecting a baby with her mystery boyfriend. Well, we know the mystery boyfriend, so we're going to speak on that. So Monica Garcia is pregnant and in shock. Now, the Real Housewives of Salt Lake City alum told the Vile Files podcast listeners Thursday that baby number five is on the way in her first child with her 29-year-old boyfriend. Hmm. Okay, the Bravo Liberty who has yet to reveal her partner's identity, which again, we're going to reveal, claimed that she was on birth control when she found out that she was expecting. Hmm. I literally went into urgent care for something totally unrelated that I thought was wrong. And the doctor came in and like was pretty much saying, you're pregnant. I was like, I'm 39. There's no way I'm on birth control. By all means, I should not be pregnant. Now, Monica praised her boyfriend for being an incredible support while they awaited the little one. But, wow. Okay. She's already the mother to four other children, Bree, Jaden, West, and Kendall, 18, 13, 7, and 6. But she was awarded sole legal and physical custody, as well as $6,000 a month in support when she and her ex-husband, Mike Fowler, finalized their divorce in October of 2023. Now, the couple previously got divorced in 2013, but apparently they reconciled. So in January, Fowler was arrested on charges of domestic violence, assault, domestic violence in the presence of a child, and interruption of a communication device after allegedly slapping his ex across the face. He was reportedly sentenced to 12 months probation and had to pay about $1,070 in fines. But Monica met her current partner while shooting a snow snowmobiling uh, scene with Heather Gay, telling podcast host Nick Bile that they exchanged phone numbers at the time. Mm -mm -mm. Can I say, when somebody is bringing in a little baby, guys, we have to, this is, it's a new life. It's a new baby. We're happy. You, even if you don't agree and you're like, you know what? That's out of wedlock. That is not somebody like you met him on a snowmobile, blah, blah, blah. You met him while filming. Things happen for a reason. I think that you can exercise like your right to show compassion and love. And this is a baby that knows nothing about any of this, about reality, Von Teese, about the burn book, about Real Housewives of Salt Lake City. That little life deserves to be celebrated, whether boy or girl. I like, which is funny coming from me because you guys know I'm not like a big baby person. And sometimes Jason says to me, he's like, I want to be a dad. And I'm like, oh, I don't know about that. But it's not my baby. But I can still appreciate the fact that if you are bringing a baby in, then you want that baby to be celebrated. And that's okay. Now, with that, everybody is wondering, and so was I. Who is Monica's mystery man? I'm like, 
jet skis or snowmobiles, whatever. Snowmobiles for ice, which is like a jet ski for ice, I guess. Same thing. Anyways, back to it. There have been photos that have been released of her mystery boyfriend, Braxton. Monica Garcia just revealed that she's pregnant with her 29-year-old boyfriend. However, when she made this big announcement, she failed to give any realty other than his first name. Now, RealityT.com decided to go full Megan King Edmonds and Kristen Doty style detective, so they found out her baby daddy and his full name is Braxton Knight. For Monica, it's now time to say goodbye to the Real Housewives of Salt Lake City and hello to Braxton and baby number five. Lord, that sounds exhausting. But no worries. They said, I have enough strength left in me to tell you about what they have gathered so far when it comes to the father-to-be. So we know that Braxton's 29 since Monica herself gave the tiniest little breadcrumb. Crumb. Oh, God, sorry. The pair met when he was 28. They said that they've also gathered that he's got a lot of love for travel he's checked himself into locations like new york city anaheim california and of course utah and monica is not pictured in any of his snaps he is cute though in utah Brax uh, braxton's main activity seemed to be hitting the gym and grinding in the snow he goes hard in both in one post he'd fallen in love with the snow the powder is what they call it and took it took him a few beats to lodge himself out of his position if you're not gonna get stuck you're not pushing yourself hard enough. He then used the hashtag, hashtag double stuck. Dude's about to get hashtag triple stuck once those diaper duties begin. In addition to hitting the gym, Braxton is also a golf fan and a Star Wars appreciator. After a recent trip to Disneyland, Braxton wrote that the little kid in me came out and I totally geeked out. Hmm. He seems like a cool guy and he's hot. So they reached out to Monica for comment, um, but apparently, as of right now, they have not received any comment. I was sitting here looking at this, and I was seeing some of the comments where people were like, oh, well, for Monica, like, this is the nail in the coffin, and she will never be back on The Real Housewives of Salt Lake City. And I'm like, I don't know about that. This kind of feels like a redemption arc. Because if she goes back onto the Real Housewives of Salt Lake City and she is pregnant with said child and she maneuvers like in the sense of, you know what, I'm bringing a baby in. I want peace. I want to right my wrongs. Even if she doesn't feel that way. For the viewers, it's Salt Lake City housewives goal. And I don't know because I'm not very uh, well versed on what the main drama is this season. We're going to find out. But what I do know is this is something that could be a potential storyline. And producers, after every single season, they're always trying to find out, okay, what's going on? What do we talk about? Where do we go from here? And they try to see what the women have to bring as far as like storylines and everything in between. Also, by the way, I heard that Mary Cosby is going to be a full-time housewife this season. And I heard that the main cast trip this season, which is going to be going to Europe, to Paris, is Mary Cosby's trip. And if Mary Cosby was a friend of, I don't think that they would give her the big cast trip. I'm just going to say. So I think, I think Mary Cosby might be in it for the long haul. But anyways, back to it. I want to hear what you guys think, especially about Monica's big announcement on Nick Vile's Vile Files podcast. What are your thoughts about her being pregnant again? And also realitytea.com or Taste of Reality, finding out that Braxton is the baby daddy. Pop off in the comment section, smash that like button, show some love, and we'll see you next time. Love you guys.